What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. What's going on, folks? How you doing? You know who I am. You know what I do. So let me get into it. Today I'm going to talk about the five lines of pro whack power. Now, there are five lines... And there's more to come, but there, these are the five main lines that I got right now. And I, you'll see why I call them lines later. There are the five lines of pro whack power. And now what these are, there's the interracial pro-blacks who think that because they're in an interracial relationship. Now when I say interracial relationship, I mean interracial as in black, white, black, maybe Latino, black, you know, and uh, Asian, black, and Indian, pro-racial. Any, if they got any parts of black in them, then they're black. But uh, Indians don't consider themselves black, by the way. Like Indians from India, you know. Different, different, whatever. Let's go ahead. Now, these pro-interracial blacks think that they can scream black power even though they're in an interracial relationship. But like I always say, if you were so pro-black, your partner will be pro-black too. Or you know, your partner will be black, period. But this is the first line of the first fuckery. Then there's the second line of fuckery, which I call the homosexual pro-blacks. Now these pro-blacks are homosexual, and these pro-blacks get the enjoyment of playing both sides of the coin. See, what they're doing, they're playing the homosexual side and the black side. So whatever side at the time is riding high, they get to ride with it. See what I'm saying? They're trying to play both sides. That's the second fucking line that we're doing. The third line are these pan skillet Africans that love Africa so much that they hate anybody that talks against it, that hates black folks who love America or just live in America and happy with America who don't want to go back to Africa. These pan skillet Africans, they love them Africa so much, but yet will never go to Africa, to the continent itself, because they are scared and they know the real facts about Africa. But don't you say that about Africa or else you're a sellout. That's the third line of these, of the, of the, of the fuckery trio. The third, pan, it's, the, it's the interracial uh, pro-blacks, it's the homosexual pro-blacks, it's the pan-skillet pro-blacks. And then we have the pro-blacks, all I want to do is yell and scream. They just they had no no foundations whatsoever. These are the pro blacks that just yell just to make their point across, you know, ah, 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 yada yada, whatever. These are the you know these are the ones that are the, the emotional blacks. These aren't the critical thinkers. These are the ones who make up shit as they go along. And now we have the fifth line of the pro black fuckery. Now, this is funny when I add all these lines up. Now, the fifth line of the pro-black fuckery, these are the lines who blame everything on the white guys, on the white men, on white people. They robbed the bank, I caught at the liquor store. They robbed the bank, they wore a fur jacket and bought a fucking, uh, you know, Bugatti the next day, and they wonder how to get arrested, you know what I mean? These are the fifth lines of the pro-black community. Now, you're saying, well, what are these, what are these lines about? Well, these lines, like, you know, and if you know where I'm going with this, there was a cartoon back in the 80s, late 80s. And what they did is these five lines came together to form Voltron. Now, these five lines, and Voltron was a defender of the universe. Now, these five lines, they come together to form Negrotron. And what Negrotron does, Negrotron defends the pro whack universe. He goes from country to country rescuing black people who are stupid enough not to know nothing. And that's what he does. These are the, these are the five lines of the pro black community. They form together to form Voltron. You know, remember Voltron? Form arms and legs. Form body. And I'll form the head. Go Voltron. You know, they get the sword. He went like that. He went like that. And that's when they stop and the light will shine on the sword. That's these ones. But. There's the only difference. 
You know how our people are. You know, they, they form the lines and like they they've been missing a leg and arm because they forgot to put gas in the lines. <laughs> so you, you know how we do. Come on. You know, the other lines will be begging for gas, you know. Other lines will, you know, well, my cousin wants a ride. Can we go? And, you know, you know, you know how they do. So I'm just going to just leave it at that. It's the fuckery of the pro black community needs to, needs to stop. You need to get rid of some of these people and you need to make them understand what, what they're doing because it's hurting your cause more than it's helping your cause. So this is kind of funny, you know. Go Negatron. So I'm out of here. Peace.